She normally just comes. Ask 11-year-old Annabella Spears to name the best Christmas ever. The answer comes right to her. Oh. She got cinnamon last year. Thrusting in your world. A stark contrast from her first Christmas, which was also her worst Christmas. Born with a rare liver disease, Annabella spent her first Christmas at Children's Medical Center in Dallas, hoping for a transplant. What would have happened if she didn't get that transplant? She would have died. But I kept thinking, is, are we going to lose her? Her parents, Shad and Alexa, say spending Christmas in the hospital wasn't ideal, but the staff made it magical. They had wreaths in the hallways and the Christmas trees. They had carolers. They just really make it feel like Christmas. And it sure felt like Christmas when a few months later, Annabella got her new liver. Super excited. Today, she's healthy, but still comes to the hospital during the holidays. Yeah. To help every kid feel magical the way that she did. Every Christmas, Annabella and her family decorate a tree. <laughs> she even designed a special ornament and the proceeds will help the patients here. Perfect. Such a simple gesture, but Annabella says lighting a tree can light up the world. Like just for like a minute, it's like nothing, like there's like no worries and like you're just a kid like celebrating Christmas, you know? Often, kids ask for a lot on Christmas and Annabella no doubt has a long wish list. But if forced to choose just one wish, she says the only wish that matters is theirs. I don't love Christmas because of like the presents and stuff. Like, of course, I do love the presents, <laughs> but like, it's like also like the decorations and like, so yeah, I would definitely choose go do that for them because I would want them to be happy, like, even if they're in the hospital. Because any Christmas you give to others is the best Christmas ever. <laughs> in Dallas, I'm Sean Giggy. I would.